it is a general reading this may or may not resonate okay if it doesn't check out your other placements if you need a personal reading all that information is going to be below so capricorn what i'm getting here is that you're feeling very guilty okay now i feel this is going to be a flip reading for most of y'all okay so let's see i feel you're feeling one person out here okay let's just say you're on this side and this is the person that you're dealing with so i feel that capricorn right now the person that you're dealing with is feeling very very guilty about what they did i feel you could be dealing with someone here who you had a breakup a separation with the tau moment has already happened between you both here and now this person wants to come back and they want to avert the disaster they want to try and rebuild this connection with you because the connection was built on a faulty foundation here now this person is in full-blown manifestation mode this person is manifesting you big time okay so i feel there could be no communication between you both because you've left this person out in the cold here okay but this person has codependency issues they cannot do without you keep that in mind this is someone here who's very kiddish not kiddish i'd say this is like a man child okay someone who constantly needs someone to uplift them they they constantly need that approval that you love them you want them you'll take care of them so there's a lot of mothering energy you know like a very motherly energy that you would have to give to this person okay so like constantly forgive them for their mistakes and constantly look over you know like uh just turn a blind eye to whatever they do etc and they come back running towards you it's like hey i'm really sorry you know will you forgive me i miss your love and you just like kind of melt down but that's the kind of energy that i see from this person out here but this person keeps coming back towards you is what i'm getting they'll keep running back they'll keep coming back they run they come they run they come so kind of commitment issues okay or probably just more not the best at expressing themselves okay you on the other hand here i feel uh that uh, either you're looking at new love right now okay and uh, you're very focused on your money your goals uh, your career you're coming up as very very stable and secure to me okay and for the seven of cups in reverse here, i feel that earlier you were you had a lot of confusion about what you wanted with this person okay or you were just living the fairy tale okay you were just living um a dream but now you're very very clear about what you want okay and uh you have like a reality check more than anything i feel you have like a reality check about what's really going on in this connection with the queen of wands in reverse and the king of wands here you're dealing with someone here who now wants to take action towards you but guess what with the strength in reverse and the devil in reverse here you've let go of this connection which was very very toxic okay and uh of course there was a codependency issue there was a lot of obsession addiction to this person but this was just a temptation which you realize and uh yeah you're no longer putting in your effort or no longer wanting to work on this connection because you've given up hope here uh there could be with the king of wands here there could be someone else who could be a leo who you're talking to or who's very passionate about you but in in regards to this connection i feel you're lacking the self confidence you're lacking the passion you're lacking the mojo okay you don't no longer are having that spark when it comes to this connection the person that you're dealing with with the tower in reverse eight of pentacles in reverse ace of cups in reverse i feel this person here now wants to make up for whatever they did okay this person was sabotaging the connection out here okay they kind of pushed you away okay they pushed away what they really wanted okay this person was not literally looking at what they wanted they were more like trying to one up you know there was someone you know who was like just wanting to win at any cost but it was an empty victory but i feel this person here now wants a reconciliation with you they see you as defeated surrendered walking away here and now they want to rebuild with you with eight of pentacles in reverse i think the, this person realizes that they're not they didn't put in the work on an individual level out here but you know what with the ace of cups in reverse here i feel you were dealing with someone here who was very damaged okay uh emotionally very damaged someone who did not want to open up emotionally someone who lacked forgiveness okay they lack self-love so what happens when someone does not know how to love right they kind of tend to um pull a lot of energies from the people who love them okay and then they kind of start to play the blame game and they make the other person make, feel very miserable this person lacks forgiveness is what i'm getting here so this could be someone who has a hard time um opening up emotionally a eh? could be someone who's depressed but could be someone who had a bad past and they haven't forgiven that person for what really happened which is why they project their fears on the current relationship screwing up the potential of the relationship okay what does this person feel deep down what does capricorn feel deep down for this person that they're dealing with what does capricorn feel deep down for the person that they're dealing with what does capricorn feel deep down for the person that they're dealing with what does capricorn feel deep down for the person they're dealing with
Okay. I wouldn't have want to take it, but okay. Um, I feel this person here know there's a lack of commitment here, okay? They know that there's a lack of commitment. There's a lack of new start here. But it's like they want to talk to you. They have the mental clarity here that they want you. And with the Six of Swords in reverse here, I feel this person is here who cannot move forward from you, okay? They can't move on from you. Uh, I feel they make the road very difficult. They know what they need to do in order to move things forward with you, but they won't do it. Okay, there's a lot of resistance from this person's side. The biggest challenge out here is for them to open up emotionally. See, this person with the King of Swords here, they don't understand emotions. They want to try and look at this situation and they want to look at every situation in a very practical, in a very logical way, okay? Which is why they come off as very cold and detached. So, you know, even if they talk to you, right, they love you deep down so much, but they're just afraid of rejection, you know, and they just feel like probably Probably this is going to be unrequited love, okay? But yes, they do know that there is a lack of stability, security, and commitment in this connection out here. There is a lack of a new start here because they feel like you're someone here who's very focused on your career, your goals, your money, okay? And right now with three of wands, I think this person knows nothing but to wait for you, okay? All right, how does this person feel deep down for Capricorn? How does this person feel deep down for Capricorn? How does this person feel deep down for Capricorn? Okay, so Capricorn, I feel like you are wanting to move forward from this person here, okay? I think you have gone into hermit mode, okay? There's a lot of contemplation that you have done or you're still doing is what I'm getting here, okay, with the hermit mode here. I think you've completely gone into isolation, all right? I don't think you're in any mood of wanting to reconcile with this person here because... Uh, uh, whatever the breakup was, right? It is something that has pushed you into um, turning away from this person out there, okay? So there's a lot of um, uh, silence from your side, okay? You've isolated yourself. You're wanting to do things on your own. You're wanting to be in that solitude, okay? So yeah, there's this search for the truth of what, when, where, how, why. There's a lot of questions and answers that you want to know, okay? So either you're taking some spiritual guidance or you could be, uh, you know, listening to uh, a lot of spiritual speakers. You know, there's just some kind of guidance that you're looking through, because with the lovers in reverse here, you feel this was a connection where you were more emotionally involved in this connection than the other person here. There was a lack of commitment, which you clearly see. And probably you felt that this was more of a temptation, more of a sexual attraction, uh, probably from that person's side, which you probably thought that you guys were on the same page here. But with the page of swords here, I feel that... Um, um, you're trying to... Uh, you're, you're keeping an eye on this person, okay? I don't feel you've completely, like... Uh, stop talking about this, stop thinking about this person. I feel there's a lot going on in your mind, okay, when it comes to this person here. But you're wanting to move forward. It's like you have no choice, but you should, okay, but you want to. Six of Swords, Ace of Wands, Queen of Swords in reverse. See the Three of Swords here. You're hurting bad, Cap. You're hurting bad, okay. This is a breakup that has hurt you. Like, it's completely cut you through. And with the Ace of Wands and the Six of Swords here, I feel you're moving towards a brand new beginning here. May not be with this person here, okay? But I think you're moving towards something brand new, moving towards your passion, okay? But with, because with the Queen of Swords in reverse here, I feel you're having a hard time forgiving this person, okay? You're not being able to move on from this person and you're not even being able to give this person a second chance even if they come towards you, okay? But uh, you're not in the right frame of mind. I feel you're looking at the situation in a very overly critical manner, very, very pessimistic, okay? That's what I'm getting here. Um, I think you could be trying to stalk on them or I feel you could also be watching a lot of tarot readings. You're trying to find out what's all really going on in their mind. But the Page of Swords is a stalker energy, okay? So yeah, it's like a lot's going on in your mind and you're just trying to uh, figure out, okay, what's really going on. There could be an idea in your mind here, but I think that idea is more about moving away from this person, okay, rather than being with them. What is the action that Capricorn will take towards this person that uh, they're dealing with? What action will Capricorn take towards this person that they're dealing with? showing that this person wants to keep rebuilding this with you it's like they know they fucked up they know they messed up 
seven of pentacles in reverse with the temperance and the nine of pentacles in reverse this person wants to be with you okay all this while this person was very happy okay very happy in their independence very happy being single on their own being the center of attraction focus on their goals their career and just you know getting attention from everyone now i feel this person here is ready to want to come towards you but again there is this sense of very scared of losing that independence that's one thing i want to tell you okay this person is codependent but they're very scared of losing their independence i'm getting someone here who's probably got everything in their life okay but you're the only one that's missing the emotional quotient is missing and that's something that they get from you uh, this person does look at this relationship as, you know, in their actions, they probably feel that this is something which is probably a waste of time. You know, that's this sense of like, okay, it's going to be a waste of time. It's just probably not going to work out because we've already separated. Maybe Capricorn's not going to give me a second opportunity here, which is why with the temperance here, I feel this person is trying to look at the situation and approach the situation with a lot of compassion, with a lot of calmness, okay? Trying to keep an open mind, trying to be very cool, calm, collected about this, okay? But with the nine of pentacles in reverse here, I feel this person definitely is wanting to come towards you and you know trying to make a compromise here the tower in reverse with the five of swords in reverse the ace of swords here okay so this person here is waiting for the right time is what i'm getting this person has a lot of mental clarity they want a breakthrough with you they want a brand new beginning with you i like the ace of swords here because this is a brand new beginning with a lot of honesty you know with with truthful communication very logical communication but like clarity you know like a breakthrough out here either this is going to make this with relationship work out or it's going to completely shut it off here but i feel this person with the five of swords and reverse here they regret a lot about what they did they regret their behavior their actions pushing you away sabotaging the connection okay and probably this person had trust issues here they were pushing away what they really wanted so they're no longer wanting to hold back no longer wanting to ignore what they really wanted okay and they're wanting to rebuild this connection they're wanting to do that okay let's see what action will this person take towards capricorn moving forward one more card one more card wow <laughs> You both want this. Oh, dude. They have the tower in reverse and you have the tower out here. You know what? I feel that um, you're um, not wanting to express your emotions to this person anymore here. I feel you're just wanting to hold back here. Uh, with the nine of pentacles in reverse here, I feel yes, you do want this person right now. Okay. But you're coming off as a little codependent, a little clingy, a little needy out here. Okay. The same as this person because you both have nine of pentacles in reverse in your actions here. Okay. I think you're both single right now, okay? But uh, the thing is here that you're both feeling very guarded right now, okay? You're both wanting to put in your best efforts, okay? And desire to spend your life with this person out here, okay? But you're both having a hard time opening up, okay? You're both not addressing what you both are fearing out here, okay? So you could both be experiencing a lot of love, you know? Uh, with, uh, you know, you need to get more love without fear i think you're both fearing this relationship the only difference is that this person feels this could be something which could be a waste of time or they could be very disappointed here and you on the other hand with the seven of pentacles there are chances that you're still waiting and watching okay so you still have hope on your side out here and with the tower the four of swords and the seven of wands in reverse here see temperance you both have the temperance here so which means that you're both kind of surrendering this connection to the universe okay it's like if it's meant to be it's meant to be out here just that you're someone here who has more hope you're holding back emotionally okay this person out here is wanting to come towards you they have clarity here but they're still shut off emotionally okay so yeah they want to be with you but they're like still like you know i'm getting like i'm leaving it to the universe if this is meant to be it's meant to be here but they do have the clarity here they, that they want a new beginning with you i think you're trying to sleep over it is what i'm getting okay you're just taking a break out here but with the tower here definitely there's like a huge realization a huge epiphany you know that you've had out here and i think with the seven of wands in reverse here i think there are chances that you're no longer wanting to uh, fight for this connection okay it's like yeah like with the tempers like i said right if it's meant to be it's meant to be Okay. But there is no action coming on from both sides out here because I feel you're both being very patient and uh, very cool, calm, collected wherever you guys are here, you know, and uh, you're trying to take like one day at a time, but trying to be very balanced. Okay, no one is being uh, very uh, overly involved. Okay, there is no excessive behaviors out here. But um, I definitely like to see what it. Oh. 
Let's see the page of swords here. What is this page of swords? Because I feel like you are keeping an eye on them. What's the page of swords? Probably even waiting for communication from them. What's the page of swords? What's the page of swords here? Try for the page of swords. Three of cups. Oh, babe, you do want a reconciliation with this person right now. You do. And that's what you're, you're waiting for communication from this person, you know. And you've isolated yourself. You're trying to do the best of trying to recoup, okay, trying to regain um, uh, whatever the self-confidence here. But you need that time alone out here, okay. But yeah, you're just trying to keep an eye on this person and probably this is what you want. You want a reconciliation here, but you're just going to wait for this person to approach you, okay. But you're both very guarded in love, both of you out here. What's the Knight of Cups in Reverse? Why are you emotionally shut off? What's the Knight of Cups in Reverse? Knight of Cups in Reverse. Yeah, see, you're not opening up emotionally because this is a situation which has been very disappointing out here, okay? You're still crying over spilt milk, very focused on the past, very focused on what then work out between you both here. And um, uh, with the Ten of Cups in reverse here, I feel that you're not ready for this relationship or you're just like, uh, you know, more like um, not sure if this is a relationship or just going anywhere. I feel one more thing that probably you're not even ready to express this uh, emotions right now, okay? Because you're not lacking, you're, you're lacking the courage to open up to this person because you probably feel this is something which is, uh, you know, it's like um, you get, um, you probably get the idea that probably, you know, uh, either there are family, there's a family situation that's involved, okay, here, which is coming between you both here, external forces that are affecting the relationship out here, okay, but you do know that right now there is um, a probability, a probability where uh, you guys um, are not really connecting with each other. This is a situation that's draining you out emotionally more than making you happy. So I feel you're just trying to want to you know just wanting to keep yourself away from any kind of turbulent times right now okay you feel unloved by this person but i do feel that you're into isolation okay not really ready to be with this person right now or express anything um uh, seven of pentacles in reverse why is that why is the seven of pentacles in reverse why do they feel i think this person is very impatient is what i no, not impatient but oh Ah, see this person out here with the page of wands and reverse here. This is why they keep thinking about communicating with you. Because they feel that it's just going to be a waste of time and it's just not going anywhere. Okay, that's what's happening. And you're both guarded in love. Which is why this person is lacking the action from their side, okay? So it's like they have an idea, they know what they want, but they lack the courage to come and make it happen, okay? So they lack that drive, that motivation. Because it's like they've already made up that mind that it's not going to work out with you. So why waste time? So it's like, Everything's like left to the universe. Yep. So, yep, that's about it. And um, hope this reading resonates. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.